this is uh, hi hi everybody this is the facts uh, I'm sitting here I'm, I'm standing here they're sitting uh, uh, um, Bern Nix Andrew Volotowski Beth Griffith Jim Theobald um, and we're about to we're, we're going to create here the sixth installment of this uh, work uh, on the facts called Charlie's Fantasy um, and uh, this guy Charlie is uh, he wants to write novels but he doesn't uh, he, and he's a really good writer. His writing can fly off the page like it's like it's the reader's thoughts. Uh, and, and what Charlie wants to do, he, he, he really wants to decode his friends' personalities. to Charlie wants to feel someone's love for him really feel it like the rain or cold or you know tuna fish and he's worried that his insights might stop that love and sometimes Charlie feels lost because he's so cautious his caution removes him from himself and this is very scary it's dangerous. During his hermit time, Charlie bloomed like a rose. Uh, he found more pieces of his, of his childhood self. <laughs> so, 
So as, um, as Charlie's uh, artistic ambitions shrank, uh, he, he became a, a craftsman and a, a businessman. He opened up his own business, and he, cause he, he found business engrossing, and compared to writing, it was relaxing. And uh, business led to politics. Politics led him to a big salaried TV interviewer job. <laughs> sort of an open marriage with his first wife. She was a banker, and her name was Banana. And um, she thought he had, that he had, occasion, he, he had occasional flings, and she thought that these were inevitable, and she was confident that their relationship could not be duplicated, um, and uh, b they preferred to spend most of their time together, um, as well as the remoteness of their early sex life, the stiffness, the of their early sex life evolved into a kind of a skillful, delicate relations that portended uh, unimaginable levels of communion. And uh, she couldn't picture him leaving her. Yes, ha, 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 ha,
starts daydreaming about women, she picks that up. Charlie is afraid of being overwhelmed by a lesser adversary. So Banana found someone to have an affair with that looked like an earlier version of Charlie, the version that loved her. Charlie found out, he made her life unbearable, she moved out and married, unhappily, her Charlie Standing. Real Charlie hibernated for a while.
After he comes out of his hibernation, he's a he's a TV interviewer. He's making a lot of money. Uh, he um, he marries his his assistant. She's much younger. Her name is Thea. Uh, she's alert. She's friendly. She's self-contained. Very important for Charlie. And she has a shape he likes. Also very important for Charlie. And uh, and they have five children.
Shelley thought that um, Shelley thought that his children were the smartest, most complete people, uh, but he didn't want to see them their struggles. Um, and as they grew up, he didn't trust their affection. against it. <laughs> 